Good evening. An Amber Alert still active tonight for a missing nine year old boy, Jordan Gorman. He was upset with his parents yesterday and left his home near Valley View Road and Wanda Lane in Cheatham County around noon. Crews are still out searching at this very moment for Jordan. He's already spent one night out in the cold, and we do know that searchers have expanded their area right now. News Channel 5's Kelsey Gibbs spent the evening on the scene. She tells us people are praying for Jordan's safe return. From sunrise to sunset, law enforcement and search and rescue groups continue to look for missing nine-year-old Jordan Gorman, and even those who know the family say they are here to help. We're here 24 seven and we, we really saturated this area and he could be only 100 yards from us and we, we just, you know, he's just a small child that and we're, we're, that's why we, you know, we, we've asked for a lot more of the expertise and people out here that are, that are helping us. So we're, we're all praying that we find him. Jordan got upset with his parents Sunday afternoon and left their Cheatham County home alone. He hasn't been seen since. They're just weeping and we're weeping with them. The Tennessee Bureau of Investigation, the Cheatham County Sheriff's Office, the Tennessee Highway Patrol and others all looking for Jordan. The TBI issued an Amber Alert Monday asking the public, especially neighbors, to be on the lookout for the boy. The community says all they can do right now is hope for the best. We can encourage the workers, the all the ones that are here to help, and we can encourage the family and we can believe and um, we're hoping we're hoping and believing for the best. Pastor Gerald Pryor of New Life Community Church says he knows the Gorman family personally. We wept together and prayed together, and uh, uh, we're. It's just hard. That's that's the difficult part of being a pastor or being a friend, is um, walking with folks through hard places. Pryor says this family unfortunately is no stranger to loss. He says they buried a son a few years ago from an accident, but Pryor says he knows their faith will carry them through. The pastor is asking everyone to just pray. I know the family would say thank you for every prayer and every love that you show their way. The Cheatham County Sheriff's tells us that the search has been scaled back for rapid response teams because of the rough terrains. He also says TBI is using its plane to search and assist ground personnel. Kelsey Gibbs, News Channel 5. Kelsey, thank you. Here is another look at nine-year-old Jordan Gorman's picture. Again, he was last seen leaving his home near Valley View Road and Wanda Lane in Cheatham County. He is four foot tall with brown hair and brown eyes. He was last seen wearing blue jeans and a gray short sleeve t-shirt with red stripes on the arms. More than 1,000 of you have already shared Jordan's picture on our Facebook page. If you haven't, please grab your phone and share it now to help bring this little boy home safe.